Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, thank you so much for taking time out of your busy day and busy schedules to watch one of my videos. And if you are returning for your second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, or many more times, thank you as well for taking time out of your busy day and busy schedules to come on back and watch yet again another one of my videos. So in today's video, I have a huge haul for you guys. I have so much good stuff in this haul, like great deals, great finds. It's going to be a lot of fun. So let's get into it. Honestly, it's like a mixture of things. Like um, I have stuff from the flea market. I have stuff from Goodwill. I have stuff from Five and Below. And I have just like two things from Dollar General. Um, so let's just start with Dollar General. Or actually, I have some stuff from Dollar General, too. I shouldn't say a few things. So, it's going to be a good haul, and it's going to be fun. So, stay tuned to see the great deals. So, let's just start with Dollar General because that's probably the least fun things, I would say. I should have, like, grabbed it all. Okay. Well, I needed rubber gloves so I just got a little thing of rubber gloves and then I use this um, LA Colors contour sculpt and contour uh, shape it up so I mainly use this for the bronzer but all the colors are actually really pretty but <laughs> you'll see I have like a million of these in my room and in my like makeup bins that I need to actually just like get rid of take them to Goodwill or something but this is the color that I use for my bronzer and it's a really pretty color it works really well um, I do have another bronzer that I use as well but this is normally what I use and which one I like the best honestly so so I bought this I think this is like I don't know maybe like 325 or something I'm not sure but it's pretty reasonable Okay, so I bought some more pool, pool floats because, as most of you know, if you don't know, um, I live in Florida. It is constantly hot, and we go swimming a lot. Um, my mom has, like, she lives in a uh, 55 and older community, so um, she has, like, five different pools in there, so we're always going swimming, we're always taking floats and things like that, and so... They had 70% off of all of their floats. So I bought some more. I got the last one of this. So this was $20. So with the 70% off, this was $6. And this is the white cap rider tube. Um, we used to have a jet ski and we would like to get one again in the future. So, um... I think that you can attach this to the jet ski and use it as a tube for the jet ski. But for $6, this was an awesome deal. It's got a cup holder, it's got the rope around it, and you got a backrest kind of thing. So super nice, super great. Um, this was the last one, like I said, of this one. So I did grab that one. I bought another inner tube. I bought this one in blue um, when they were 50% off. Um, now it was only like, I think $2.25 or something. So I just got another one because I have two boys and a girl. So I figured why not buy one more. So they only had orange left. And I think this was the last one of this one, honestly, too. So I got an orange and a blue one of this. And this also has a string around it. So you probably could use this as like a tube as well um but I'm not sure I don't know if that one would be like well I guess with the weight on it of a person it might be sturdy enough and then I bought this one they did have some other ones similar to this one but um this is a good brand and this one was um also ten dollars the other one was eight dollars so it was only two twenty five I think so this one was like maybe three bucks I don't know very cheap um, so this one summer vibes it's just a long raft and it's got like the holes in the inside 
and comfy and cute. So, um, so we'll be using these at the pool as well, or I might give my mom one if she wants one. We'll just see. All right, so that was it for the Dollar General. Like I said, it wasn't a whole lot. Um, now we're gonna go to Five Below because there's not a whole lot from there. And then we'll do the flea market and then we'll do Goodwill. Shove these back in the bag a little bit. I wrote the bag. I should have put the big one in there. But that's okay. It is so hot out here. I have a fan on the ceiling and I put the fan on, but it's still super hot outside. And I put my back thing down just so my neighbors behind me can't hear me because I don't like to talk and film with people watching personally. All right, so I want to five and below. And oh, they have the cutest, cutest stuff. Like, they had so much cute stuff, and it was all, like, way too big for me. Um, like, the cutest little pajama sets. So many cute things. But, like I said, it was either, like, way too big. I, they were mostly all, like, double XLs and 3XLs. So, if you're looking for, like, pajamas, Christmas pajamas, anything like that, um, try your 5 and below. Um, especially if you're in those sizes, try your five and below. Anyways, moving on. So I needed new um, nail buffers. So I got this Diamond Cosmetics um, Blocks and Buffers three piece manicure set in the cherries. They also had this in I think a blue color. I think it was blue, I'm not sure. So um, it comes with a three piece set and this one's the triangle and these two are square. But, like I said, they're blocks and buffer sets, um, and I needed new ones of these. So, it was perfect. It was $3.25, and I love the little cherry design. I love cherries. I just think they're so cute and pretty. So, I did buy that. So, I did get one pajama set. I think it might be a little bit big on me, but I hope not. So I got the little gingerbread, which is pretty much, I think this is the only one that they had somewhat in my size. So it was $5 for the little gingerbread shorts, and then it was $5 for the top. So I did pay $10, but it is so cute. It's a really soft material. Um, I don't even know like what this material honestly is but like it's a super soft comfortable material it is a little bit on the warmer side so hopefully it'll cool down in Florida and I can wear this but how freaking adorable is that it's got little gingerbreads with Santa hats on it and I'm gonna be wearing my Halloween one in a couple days I think I did a video with that one a while back. It's it's just like this, honestly, um, but it's orange and it's got little Halloween pumpkins on it. It's so cute too. So yeah, so I bought that for ten dollars. Oop, dropping something. Hang on. Okay, and the last thing I got, I got this bag, and this is such a great deal for five dollars, you guys. This these bags are so expensive like this is the bag I was gonna get a bag like this in like flamingos and stuff on vacation and it was like I can't remember I want to say it was like 80 bucks or something so this was really nice this was the only pattern they had but I actually really like it it's just black and then the pink and orange and white stripes and then it's got the little like rope handles on it and then you have the buttons on the side, so if you need to make it bigger, you can unbutton it, and it can be bigger. Isn't that cute? Or you can button them and just use it as like a smaller duffel bag or whatever you're gonna use it for. Um, I think this is like perfect for work or anything, ouch. 
I just hit myself in the head with that strap. But it, it's super cute and such a great deal for $5 because these are really expensive, pretty expensive bags. All right, so that's it from five and below. That's probably the least stuff I got. But like I said, I would have got more, but like nothing was in my size. I broke my nail and I'm waiting because we're carving pumpkins tonight because Halloween is tomorrow. So um, we're carving our pumpkins tonight. We're just waiting for my other son to get off of school. And then I'm going to put my nails on after we carve pumpkins because I don't want to carve pumpkins. But this nail is like, it's like broke and then it's like the weirdest thing it's like a nail on top of a nail and it's broken it's just bothering me it kind of hurts actually all right where should we go next let's do the flea market stuff and i'm gonna save the best for last in my opinion today it's actually fun clothes i promise you it's good stuff but the flea market there's a lot of good things um there's not really i don't maybe there's like one shirt but flea market is good today promise so my mom got these two a two set of pillows um it was two of them brand new for six dollars so she took one and i took one they're just these little comfortable pillows like for you know you can use these for an airplane you can use these um we just like them we just like to have a little pillow to read with or you know if you're laying on your bed and you just want to it up or put it behind your back for back support whatever so it was a good deal um two for six dollars brand new and they're cute i have little pillowcases too so i'm debating i think i'm gonna save the best thing for the last in this part maybe i should have done goodwill first because ooh, that's squeaky because i have some well i have really good stuff at bowls i promise all right let me grab some other bag so we didn't get a whole lot. It was actually like really crowded. There were so many booths at the flea market to, uh, on Saturday. It was it was kind of crazy in a sense. Um, just like so packed. And I don't personally like big crowds. I don't like when it's super packed like that. Although there were a ton of vendors. So, um, but we just, we went with um, my aunt. So we didn't although she kind of went her separate way and just like walked around her own pace and me and my mom we do our own thing too like sometimes we go ahead of each other if you know if i want to dig through clothes or look at a certain booth or sometimes she wants to look at something and i'll go ahead but anyways so this lady had everything for a dollar so i got these little um she had the cutest as I'm like changing the subject but anyways she had the cutest little baby clothes for a dollar brand new with tags she's an extreme couponer um, brand new with tags for a dollar this lady like filled up like she bought like 20 baby outfits brand new like I said with tags um, for a buck it was great deal so if you had a baby or something it's highly recommended anyways so I got these little bunny frat uh, bunny, I can talk bunny fabrics um, so I'm gonna use these again for my makeup table I just put like little fabric on top of my makeup table because it's white and I don't want to get it all dirty and ruined so I got two of these just I don't know how big they are well hello my kitty she wanted to say hi I guess so I bought little Easter ones because um, I have Halloween ones and now I have Easter ones. Sorry, I gotta move my cat. Thank you, Sky. All right, so then she had this uh, little Guess Who card game and we all love Guess Who, so um, I figured for a buck, everything was a dollar or it was um, six for five dollars. So. I bought this little guess who card game so like I said we we love guess who I love guess who honestly and so I thought it'd be fun um, I don't know how the card game will work I guess pretty much the same 40 face cards 20 mystery cards 
the original guessing game, now a fast, fun card game. So yeah, so I got that. <clears throat> my mom got my stepdad a belt, so I just got my husband a belt. So just this black belt, silver buckle, it's like brand new, it's a really nice belt. And then I did buy one t-shirt from her, because like I said, it was a dollar, so I figured you know, the, her stuff's all brand new. Um, this one, maybe the tag fell off. Because I know she had like four of these. So I just got him this, um, this car's t-shirt. It's got a Corvette. It says, the legend lives on. So it's just got two fancy cars on there. So I figured he could just wear this. Um, this is a nice little t-shirt for school and whatever. Alright, let's see what else we got. Next, I bought my son. So, if you watched the one of the previous videos that I did, I bought my son a $5 really nice Nike book bag. It's super, super nice. So, he actually needed a new lunchbox and this was $4. I didn't even argue with her on it because that was such a great deal and it is, again, a brand new a brand new Nike lunchbox so it's really really nice it's got an outer zipper here and a big pretty big deep compartment in the front just Nike and it's blue and then oh maybe maybe it's not brand new but it looks pretty much brand new so and you got a little compartment here and you got like the big plastic thing in here um, it isn't removable, but I actually kind of like that it's plastic inside because um, it's so much easier to clean when this is plastic. When it's like this material, I am always constantly washing my son's lunchbox and cleaning it out the best that I can. Um, I actually threw one in the washing machine the other day to see if I could wash it like that, and it, it was fine. It didn't shrink or anything, which I was glad. I mean, I didn't dry it. I just, like, set it on the counter to dry. But, still, this is so nice for $4. Such a great deal. So, now he's got a little nice, very nice matching lunchbox to go with his new book bag. Alright, so they had a garage sale and my mom's development um, when we were going to the flea market the other day. So we stopped at the garage sale and I did get, actually I did get one thing from the garage sale. It's really cute. Let me grab it. So I bought this little shelf. It was $5. It's like brand new and it's so adorable. It's got these little white flowers on it. It's got a drawer here. Um, so the top part looks like this. My cat's coming to see. Watch out, baby. So yeah, and then it's just got like two shelves here. So I thought it was really nice if my cat would get out of the way. This guy, no, right now, please. So yeah, super cute, super nice, and I really like it. Hang on, guys. I gotta let my cat back in because she's clawing at the door right now. So I'm gonna pause this for one quick second and let her in. So yeah, that's it's a really cute cabinet. I paid five dollars for it. I thought it was a good deal. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna do with it quite yet, but I really do like it. So I'll either put it in like my bathroom or my kids' bathroom maybe, or um, I don't know. But I'll find somewhere to put it because it is super cute for five bucks. Alright, so this is the last thing and most of you are going to think this is probably the best thing. This isn't the last thing of the whole haul, but this is the last thing from the flea market. And again, um, you guys will probably think that this is the best thing. So there was one booth when we first got there and these, this lady and her daughter had... Um, so much great stuff. Honestly, it was a little bit overpriced in my opinion. Some of it was, some of it wasn't. But, like, 
if you're trying to get rid of that stuff at the flea market and you do all that work, like she had shorts and pants and she was asking $4 each. I don't know. To me, that just seemed high. Like, and, and once people, other people were like, you know, grabbing them and stuff, um, they were like, how much are these? And we were all kind of like grabbing a pile and then she said $4 each and we all like put a lot of it back because I don't know $4 just seemed really high but I did get this Juicy Couture black brand new duffel bag for my daughter bought this one for her it's so cute unless I decide to keep it but it's just the juicy black duffel bag and I paid $15 for it which is a pretty good deal um because she probably paid I'm guessing around 40 I'm sure at like Burlington or something so you got a little front pocket here and then you got the short straps you got the long strap it's just the juicy duffel bag but then the inside, um, the inside's really big, nice and big. And then I got a uh, pouch back here, a zipper pouch in the back. That's very big, very, very good size as well. So yeah, so I paid $15 for this. Again, brand new with tags, super great deal and super cute. So I got that as well. All right, we're going on to Goodwill, but again, stay. I will show you guys the other stuff that I got first from Goodwill, and then I'll do the clothes, because I know not everybody likes clothes videos, but I think I got some cute stuff today. So let's get into it. So I got these sandals for $4.00. They are the um, Italian shoemakers. They are so soft, so comfortable, and so cute. Just little black sandals, the little rhinestone um, circles on them. And then they're just like a little bit of a wedge. They're really cute for four bucks. This is a great deal because they are so soft and comfortable. Um, this one has a little bit of like indenting, but once I mean you can't even really see well there you go you can see it better now but when my foot's in it you don't even notice and again for four bucks figured why not now these ones were ten dollars and I did not buy them last time because they were ten dollars but I absolutely freaking love them and they fit so nice and they're just so cute and I was like you know what I'm getting them. So I got these adorable strappy sandals and they have the little heel, perfect size heel honestly. They are so cute and they're like this, um, I don't know what color you'd call this, like a taupe or maybe like a dark beige or something. But it's definitely like a neutral color and they go with a lot of things and they are just so pretty. I, I absolutely love them. So I did cave and pay the $10 and I bought them and they fit so nicely on my feet. They're the perfect size. Um, and they're seven and a half, but, and they looked so cute with this one dress I got. Like, I will definitely be wearing these, with the, especially with the one dress I got. And I'll show you guys that in a minute as well. So those were the shoes I bought. <laughs> okay, let me just make sure. Okay, the rest is closed. And I did forget a bag from the flea market of clothes. Um, but I'll just show you that in a minute as well. Alright, so next I bought this lamp from Goodwill because I just really love the color of it and I thought it was so cute. So it's this little lamp. Um, this was $5.99. Today was red tags were 50% off and green tags were the $1.49 today. And that's when I went and got this. 
look how cute this is. Like, it just stands on a table. I love the color. And I just love the shape of it. I just thought it was so cool. I thought this would be really pretty. Like, I want to put it because it matches all my decor, my whole color scheme of my bathroom. But then again, I want to do my bedroom in this color as well. So, I think I'll probably put it next to my bed for now and then try to, like, buy other decor in these colors because I love this color. And, you know, it's definitely, like, a floury color. So, it's like a, um, like, um, I can't even describe what color it is, but it's like a, a greenish blue. Is that a turquoise? I don't know. I can't think right now, but... I got that lamb. Here are my cats. I'm going to knock it down out here. So I'm going to put it back on the table. Give me one second, guys. I am going to pause this one more quick second because my husband's on the phone inside and he just got home from work a minute ago. Um, so I don't want you guys to like hear him in the background and stuff. So one sec. I'm going to shut the door. <sighs> things I do for you guys because I'm doing my video out here like I said I do have a big ceiling fan in our lanai which is nice however it doesn't really help it's so hot in Florida <laughs> and it's so hot outside all right let me get a sip of water <clears throat> just so you know I didn't forget about my other video by the way um with my scary stories and I have like a really cool story to tell you guys um again about my brother so I'm really excited to share that with you guys so I think I'm hopefully hopefully we have so much to do today honestly but I'm hoping that I can get it done today because I do want to post it of course before Halloween um because it's a Halloween video and I don't know I just want to post it before Halloween instead of after Halloween. But if I don't get to posting it today or tomorrow, um, I promise you guys I did not forget about the video and I will be doing it and posting it soon. All right, so let's go to the bag from um, the flea market that I forgot. So this guy had brand new clothes. Um, I know this guy. Um, I've bought in designer bags from him before. I've bought in like Steve Madden bags. I bought, what else did I buy from him? He's had a lot of designer bags. He actually like cleans out storage units and then he, um, you know, takes what he wants or does what he wants with most of it. And then he has, he has a booth at the flea market and he sells the rest. So this time he did go. So he had, there was I guess a bunch of clothes new with tags. So I paid $3 for these. So I got this like purple um, and stars. It's It's got a skirt and it's got like the hole in the tummy area and a little tie here. These are really actually like pretty cute on me. I wish it wasn't like short sleeve. Again, it's the same material as the pajama set from Five and Below. So it is a little bit on the warmer side, but this is Sadie and Sage. Um, it was on clearance at, it looks like um, Bell's Outlet for $7.50. I don't know if you guys can see that originally. And he was charging $3 for everything new with tags and $2 for everything um, without tags. But most of it was all brand new. So I got that outfit. Then I got this. I like this a lot. So this is by Love Change. This one's a size large. What size is that one? Let me see. This one. I don't really know what size this one is. I would say probably maybe a medium. All right, so this one's a large. So we got this cute little flower dress. All right, sorry, my husband's like, you want me to cut your pumpkin for you? I'm like, heck yeah. If I would have done that, I would have done my nails before I did this, but that's okay. So this 
So I got this super cute ruffled um, flower dress. It's really cute. And it's just like a tank top. And then it's just a short little like, I don't know. I say a cowboy, cowgirl kind of dress. Little country dress, but I think it's adorable. I love it. I am a flower girl, y'all. I like flowers. I like wearing flowers. And then I just bought this leopard um, romper. Super cute. Just got a little V. Again, new with tags. It says size small. It says it was $34 originally. So I paid $3 for it. Just a cute leopard romper with pockets. Very cute. And this one is really nice material. This is the only one um, new without tags, but I think you charge me three for each of them. Oh, that's okay. Because they're all really cute. Alright, so now we're done with the flea market stuff. So we're going to finish the Goodwill clothes, and then we're finished. Alright. Let me start off with, I got my son some clothes, because he really needs some new clothes. So, um, these were $5.99, these super cute little shorts. So, it's kind of hard, because he's very small. My ex, um, which is his father, he he looks so much like him um but he's built like him and he was very short very skinny so unfortunately my son is not going to be that tall but he is growing he has grown quite a bit thankfully um but he's in that weird like clothes group thing like some stuff's either just too big on him or some stuff is just too small on him like He's just like in this really weird, awkward, in-between stage, which I hate. So hopefully these will fit him. They are not adjustable, which was the only thing that I was a little bit worried about because his tummy is really skinny and they are size 16 for boys. Um, but I think that they should fit him and be pretty good. They, they, look, they look like they will, so I'm hoping because... They're really nice shorts for $5.99. Then I got him a couple shirts. I wasn't sure if I was going to get this one, but, you know, um, he's in high school, so he, um, you know, I can't buy him any, like, the cartoon shirts and stuff because he won't wear that stuff, so... So I just found him this, like, football t-shirt. I hope it's not too, like, kiddish for him. And this was $3.99. Just got a little football on it. Then I bought him this one. This one was $5.99, but it's really, really soft and very lightweight and very comfortable. I think this is, like, the Hurley brand. Is that how you say it? Hurley? I don't know. I think. But it's just a blue t-shirt some writing on it but this is my favorite so this shirt was um, $5.99 but it was 50% off because it was a red tag so I got him this black shirt with like pinstripes and then they had these in the men's section and they are an extra small and they were only $3.99 for these and they look like brand new so I got him these adorable khaki shorts which I really think that these will fit him really nicely. So I'm super excited about that. And they were only four bucks. They were like such a great deal. So I thought this, these little khakis with this striped pinstripe shirt would be so handsome on him. So that's what I got for him. Then I bought my daughter's two tops. So I got her this leopard tube top. It looks a little bit big, so I hope it's not too big on her, but it was only $3.99, so I figured I'd take a chance on it because I thought it was really cute, and she likes leopard too, so I think she'll really like it. So I got her that one, and then I bought her another one. It's the wedding out here, you guys. Like 
you're really like if like I said if you haven't watched my previous video like Florida gets so boring and so annoying with the heat like I just want it to cool down just a little bit so I also bought her this little black one with the little lace it's got lace on the bottom and the top I thought this was so pretty and then it crisscrosses in the back the straps I really really liked this she better like it I don't buy her a whole lot anymore because she doesn't usually like what we buy her me or my mother while well, she hates the stuff my mother buys her and some of it is ugly I must say I love my mother but some of it isn't the greatest and then some of it is actually really really cute and she just doesn't like it all right Moving along, I got this little bathing suit cover up. It is so cute. So it is a long, just white, see through um, bathing suit cover up. It was $5.99. But it's, it's long and then it's got slits on both the sides. And I tried, the, I tried this all on and it looked really, really cute on, honestly. So I bought it. I thought this was so such a cute bathing suit cover up that looks sexy and it shows my curves and I liked it honestly all right and this was such a great deal too this was a red tag and it was originally $3.99 so I only paid two dollars for this pretty skirt and it's just a black skirt and it fits me so nicely and it looks it looks good it's cute and it actually feels really nice too so just got this little black um, skirt for two bucks again great deal all right then throw this back I guess you know what I don't know why like I thought this was gonna be a lot longer but it seemed like it bringing all this stuff outside that's why I don't do my videos outside as much you guys because like I have to bring it all outside then I have to bring it all back inside when I'm done and it's so hot out here a lot of times so but again I don't know why but you guys watch more of my videos when I do them outside so I figured why not do it outside all right so I got another leopard romper this one is a medium by pink lily and it was also $5.99 this one's cute. This one's a little bit, I don't know if I love like the top part of it. Like, I don't know. It fits me. It's a teeny tiny bit like tight on me maybe, but it's got the little um, bow and it doesn't have pockets. Just sad, but it's still cute. It's still cute. It's a cute little romper with the little bow and everything. It looked good on me, so I ended up getting it, and it was only $5.99, so I didn't think that was bad. <laughs> Alright, and the very last bag. Some of you might think this is ugly, which I'm going to start with this. But again, and like, I don't know if I really liked it. I almost didn't even try it on, but when I tried it on, I think I look really good in the color white, honestly. Like, white is just my color sometimes. Um white and like that very pretty bright blue are my colors that's at least what everybody tells me so it actually looks a lot cuter on so I got this little blue and white I'm gonna put this down so you guys can see this better um, this was $5.99 by the way and this is it's no boundaries it's a size large from Walmart and again, it's that same, like, warmerish material, but it's just cute. I don't like that it has the, the breast pads, but it's still very cute. It's got the wraparound on the stomach and the blue flowers, and it's just white. And it's comfortable and soft and cute, so I got it. Next, I bought this long romper, and again, okay, so... I think I just have to, I'm hoping that if I just adjust the straps a little bit tighter, that this will look a little bit better on me. 
because the top part just was a little bit big. It is a large. This was $7.99, but this is so cute. I love this green color. I really do. So it's a tank top, and then it's like long, flooded pants. So I'm going to show you guys this one. Try to. So it's got like the wide pants, but it fit like the length and everything on me. Like, it really fit awesomely. I don't even think you guys saw it that great with me doing that, but it's super cute. So again, it's got like the little like reaching detail around the stomach and it is attached. And it was just cute. And it's actually like pretty lightweight and comfortable as well. So I got that. Next, okay, some people might think this dress is ugly, but it is really cute on and it's super, super soft and comfortable. It was $5.99, and this is from Wild Fable, which I believe is Target brands. So I definitely need to wash it. And the boobs are a little bit stretched out, but I think that, again, if I adjust the straps a little bit more, I can fix them. Now some of you, again, might think this is so ugly, but I think it is so cute. So this is like turkey, turkey turquoise like a uh, turquoise color it looks blue in the camera honestly but it's like really a like a green color it still looks blue in the camera I swear it's green though it's definitely green I ain't colorblind I promise but yeah how cute is that that is funny though like it seriously looks so blue on my camera and like me looking at it is definitely like a turquoise green. Looks prettier on my camera. <laughs> no, it's really cute. It's comfortable and it's cute. All right, next I got these little black shorts for four dollars. They were three ninety nine. Just little comfortable black shorts, and they have a little tie here. They're a little bit small, but um, they're not really small, but I can't shrink them anymore. Let's just say that. Almost done, guys. Almost done. Because I'm hot. I got this blue shirt, which was $5.99 too, which I kind of thought was a little high. It's a, <clears throat> sorry, <clears throat> it's a medium. And I didn't like got a little tiny like tie knot thing on the bottom which I didn't really like but it's again super lightweight super very very comfortable material and just really nice just with like my blue jean shorts or something I thought it was just like a cute little tank top to wear with that okay the next couple things are the bargains well bargains ish so this little romper was $3.99. Now this material is amazing. And I think this is the Target brand too, but I'm not positive. But it feels like a Target brand. I can't read what that says. Something Gilliam, Gilliam? Gilliam and O'Malley, I don't know. This is size medium and this is a really really extremely comfortable cute little black and white romper and I only paid $3.99 for this sorry my cat's getting in the way again big kitty and yeah for $3.99 this was a steal I actually saw this hanging up by the shirt so I don't know if somebody like just left it there or whatnot but this is so so comfortable and so cute and it's just like I said, oh, this is like that awesome, just super soft material. All right, let's see. I'm going to say that my, well, I don't know. These last two are both my favorite. So this is the dress I actually tried on with those shoes. And you wouldn't really probably think it would match, like just seeing it. But it actually looked so cute with the shoes. I wasn't even going to get this dress and I wasn't even going to try it on because 
I've had dresses like this before. Never wore them, blah, blah, blah. But it was a size large. It is J for Justify, and it was only $5.99. And how freaking cute is this dress? It's I'm going to show you guys again. I'm moving my chair just to show y'all. Look at this. Like, it's got the, like, cream-colored top and then the skirt. And then the skirt is long in the back. And it's got, like, the underskirt. I used to wear these dresses after I had kids. Literally all the time. I had, like, four dresses like this. And I absolutely freaking loved those dresses. They were like my favorite outfit. And I wore them constantly, you guys. So, but it, it really did look cute on me. So I did end up getting it. Oh, and that one was $5.99. Alright, and this is the last one. And I didn't know if I liked the bottom of this. But it actually looked so cute on me and I love the top part even though it's just black but this is from Sheen and this was six dollars and it was 50% off so it was only three dollars it does look like it had a belt which is missing but that's okay because it actually looks really really cute on and it's just this like I said I didn't know if I liked the bottom part of this to be completely honest but on me, it looks so, so cute, actually. And it's just got, like, the little V on the top part. And this black with the stripes is so pretty on me, too. So, I actually really, really love this romper. And I only paid $3 for it. Which, again, was such a steal. Alright, you guys. Well, it is almost time for my son to get home from school. And we're going to carve our pumpkins. And, sorry, my husband asked me something and interrupted my video. So, yeah. Um, so, I will be making that other video very soon. I don't know what I was saying before he interrupted me. I'm sorry. Um, me and my mother are going to the flea market again on Saturday. <laughs> um, so, hopefully, we'll have new finds and stuff for another video for next week. But, again, I will be posting that other video for Halloween. Hopefully, tomorrow I will be able to post it because tomorrow is Halloween. Um, if not, I will... I'm going to try to post it before Halloween. But if I cannot do it, um, then I will try to post it hopefully Monday or Tuesday. Or Monday or Tuesday. I mean, I keep forgetting it's like a weekday. It's Monday, so... Um, I'll probably either post it if I, if I don't get the chance, um, I'll post it on Wednesday or Thursday. So it'll be a couple days after Halloween, but I'm hoping to get it on before Halloween. So we'll see, but I hope you all have a wonderful day and thank you all so much for watching. I hope that you will hit that like button if you like this video and I hope that you will subscribe and put those notifications on so you can see when I post other videos and I will see you all in the next one. Bye!